going on YouTube? Back with another video, Shaboy B F man. We got nice workout today. A lot of focus on the shoulders today. A lot of, a lot of you guys um, messaged me about how you are not seeing any development in your shoulders. And uh, we are pretty much, I think I might just dedicate this whole workout for shoulders, even though I told you last video that I'm doing a majority of full body training. So we might, I mean, we might do something outside of the shoulders. We probably will, I'm not sure. But this video is how you can increase your shoulder muscularity and strength in one. This, that's the main focus of this video for you guys today. Now, make sure you hit that like button if you're liking the things that I'm saying right now, if you're excited about the video. Um, if you wanna wait until after the video, hit that like button, then awesome. Let's just start out the video. My protein use code AFTERMATH for 40, 40% 40 off. We have a lot of Black Friday sales. Um, things coming on for you guys. So be looking out for that. I mean, Black Friday, come on. <sighs> don't, um, don't look up what Black Friday is actually meant for, but yeah, <laughs> America, right? But anyways, the mocha protein, plant-based protein, I'm telling you guys, you will not be disappointed. I got the big Jehoshaphat of it, 25 grams of protein per scoop. I take two scoops uh, two times a day, so I get 100 grams of protein from this plant-based protein with four grams of glutamine, four grams of BCAs um, in each scoop. So be looking out for that. If you don't like the milky type of um, proteins, we have the Clearway Isolate Proteins. This is more of like that fruit punchy, um, non-proteiny tasting type of stuff. And we then have the Clear Vegan Isolate. Um, somebody's going to like it. So, yeah. All right, let's get to the gym. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. All right, we back at the gym, YouTube. So check this out. Shoulders, you must warm up. Don't, don't go into shoulders, go into a strictly, uh, uh, overhead press or whatever, trying to go heavy. Shoulder is probably the most sensitive. It probably is. It's the most mobile and sensitive part of the body because you have so much range of motion and there could be so much error in that range of motion that you need to properly warm up. That's one thing that I've always pretty much taken care of is my shoulders. So we're gonna do a routine that I use with the band to warm up all around, full range of motion. Starting out, you saw this in my last video. We're gonna do 10, we're gonna do three sets of 10. Starting first exercise, is gonna be right here. Band pull aparts, one, two, three. And if you pull your hands in closer, you get a little bit more resistance. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. And then dislocations, one, two. When you're doing these, make sure, try not to bend your back like this. Try to stay upright as much as possible, squeeze the glutes when you're doing this because you're making it easier when you go like this to get the, to get the, uh, the band back. You stay up like this, it's a lot more work. One, 10, take a quick break, 25 seconds, same thing. 10 pull apart, 10 dislocations. I wanna do that for three sets. Three, four, the next step up from the bands is actually using like one of those pipe poles just because you can't pull that apart, you can't stretch it to your, you know, whatever. And it's just a straight back and forth. That's like an advanced. All right, so moving on, we're gonna do right here, a little bit more rotator cuff action. And we're gonna go 15 reps each side. 15. Switching sides. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 14, 15. Switching over. Now we're going back. Elbow back first. 10 reps. In. Two. Five. Eight. Nine. Ten. Three. Four. Now, now, I'm able to use a 45 pound bar doing this, but if for those who are new to doing this, what you can do is get the, you know, the curl bars and a little bit le lesser weight. Um, but we're going to do a snatch, snatch grip from a seated position. The reason why we're turning from the seated position is because it takes the, the legs 
out of the movement. And also for those who have issues with the traps. Now the traps, like if, you, if you're like myself, um, if you have tight traps, those are a big factor in why your shoulder development is not as great as it could be as far as um, just pretty much the composition of them. Into, you have to overdo pretty much everything and uh, try to keep your traps out of it. But right now what we're gonna actually do is engage our traps with the shoulders right now. When they're warmed up, there's a little bit more ability to have separation and feeling in the traps and in the shoulders. Eight reps, we're gonna do four sets to start out. I was talking like I was about to say something right after that. We're gonna do four sets to start out. Okay, what else? One. After this, we're pretty much done. So it's like the warm up. We're gonna go overhead and we're going to go up, down. Two, three, 15 uh, reps. 12, 13, 14. Uh, so that's overhead shrugs. Uh, I done these a long time ago. It's been a while since I've had these in video, but I had a video a while ago when I was in New York when I was doing uh, 315 overhead shrugs. I might do something today, maybe not. Maybe, maybe so. I don't know, but once again, we have to separate the engagement of the, the shoulders and the traps. A lot of people think that, you know, when you do laterals, let's say, the traps can overtake your laterals, which is why you're not seeing development in your laterals, on your lateral head for your shoulders. So when we, we want to have a muscle mind, I mean, put pretty much muscle mind connection with these certain muscle groups so that we can get more feeling in our movements when training for you know laterals, front delt raises, um, rear delt raises, without having to engage the traps so much. So what helps me is starting out the workout with engaging my traps, activation, getting the blood flow in them, so I can feel feel the difference in training certain muscle groups. Ah. ah. Also when it comes to shoulders, time under tension will be your friend. It's all about how long you can last with each set. So right here, we're gonna go halves, 50, 50%. 50 One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Rest 10 seconds. Two, three, four. one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Rest ten seconds. Two, three, four, five again. One, half. Two, three, four, five. I mean ten. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's one set. We're gonna do this three times. Those holds. Those holds, you're still gonna feel it in your in your uh, in your shoulders. First exercise done. We're gonna grab a plate, I grab a 25. 25 is what's good for me. We're gonna go upright. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
Nine, 10, dropping it down, coming all the way up overhead. One, two, three, four, squeeze at the top. Nine, 10, relax. 30 second rest, same thing, three sets. So we start in the front. Uh, coming out. One. Touch. Two. Three. Four. Eight reps. Four. Eight. Back down. Got four sets of eight. Cardinal press. Body wise, as you see, I think I'm at 236 right now. Uh, it's just my lower back fat, and this that's really tough. But then again, we've been eating like we had five guys last night. I had two bacon cheeseburgers. We had what before that? Pizza. I had Chick-fil-A earlier, Chick earlier that day. So I had fast food twice yesterday. I had in and out three, four days in a row. We had pizza. We had pizza. This is like the last week. So, but I'm living comfortably. Like, that's why I say, I like, I, I like to live comfortably. You know, whenever I feel like I need to clean my shit up, I clean it up. But majority of the time, I just kind of eat freely. Um, but yeah, the thing about it is, I don't, I don't have to compete. I don't do any of that. If I wanted to have a pizza, I enjoy having a pizza. Ain't got to stress about dieting down for some show or none of that shit. You know what I'm saying? So this is how I like to live. A lot of a lot of guys, you don't have to have a full-on purpose to be shredded year-round, bro. Like, you know, be a little bit more realistic because it's like being shredded a year-round is, you know, like, I don't know why you would want that life. I really don't. If you want to be super healthy, you know, awesome. That's good. I'm glad to hear. But you ain't going to catch me doing that. We eat pizzas around here. You feel me? We eat burgers a little too much. You gonna get pizza tonight? No. I was supposed to try to keep her on diet, but how am I supposed to keep her on diet when I can't stay on diet? Diet. All right, so that's the end of today's workout. What we're gonna do right now is actually just a little cool down that I like to do at the end of my shoulder routines. It's a simple 20 rotations forward. Get a resistance band, come out as far as you can. Rotations, 20 forward. Uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, nineteen, twenty, twenty back. One, two, three, four, nineteen, twenty. We're gonna face it. Twenty to the left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twenty, twenty to the right. We do the same thing on the other side. Five, six, seven, and that is the full workout. Thank you guys for watching the channel. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button for your boy. Also comment below what kind of videos you would like to see from me on any type of body part or any thoughts um, that you have that you want answered from me. So that being said, catch me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash TV. Also, all programs are at aclan.com. Damn, I was about to say net. 
All programs are at aclan.fitness, so definitely hit that link below if you are looking for programs for yourself, not just some bodybuilder style workouts. We're talking about athletic movements, we're talking about mobility, being explosive, and strength and conditioning as well. Check it out. Peace out. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny.